Revivals, Georgia. How are you doing today? I'm doing good. Great. Well, you just ran the second fastest time in the 400 in the country today. How does that feel? I feel proud of myself because at first I thought I couldn't do it, but now I feel more confident in my, in my other races that I went to. Okay. Um, you also ran a very fast time today in your 200. Um, you ran a, a, a 24 uh, plus low change. And so um, you do have a lot to be proud of today. <laughs> and so now that 400 um, field that you were in was, was heavily loaded. I mean, it's a very talented field. And so um, the only person who actually beat you ran the fastest time in the country. <laughs> yeah. so, out of the same heat. So, uh, do have you met some of the young ladies who were in your heat with you today or uh, before today? Um, no, this is my first time seeing them. Okay. Um, do you run a lot on the national circuit? Yes. Okay. All right. So, uh, what was your uh, what was your time coming in today? My time coming in was a fifty-five oh something. Oh, okay. Or 55, high 55. Okay, so you just decided to just kick that one to the side and get yes. this up. <laughs> okay. Yeah. And how about your um, 200? Was this the fastest time that you ran? For this season, yes. All right, all right. Well, how long have you been running? Um, since I was in the fourth grade. Oh. And you're a senior this year or I'm a sophomore? sophomore? Okay. Oh, wow. So, as a sophomore, you just come down here to Kentucky and you just take the second fastest time in the country, you just, you know, like it was nothing. Yes. <laughs> no, seriously, though, no, that, that, that was a very good race. Uh, it was It was a very competitive race, and, and so you did a great job um, with that time. So, um, tell us about um, some of your other accomplishments in track and field, especially last year. How did you do last year um, doing outdoor and indoor? Last year, my outdoor PR, in my 200, it was a 24.03. In mm -hmm. my 400, it was a 54.07. Okay. So I'm pretty close to my PR now. Okay. All right. And so um, where did you finish in the state of Georgia in your races? So you were second in Georgia, now you second in the United States, so I guess you got a new goal now. Yes. <laughs> All right. So um, how many races do you have, or how many meets do you have after today? I have one more, and it's the New Balance meet. All right. So you looking forward to um, New Balance, and because and, um, I'm pretty sure that some of the people who you ran against today yes. are going to be there again. Yes, and I plan to PR that meet too. All right, all right. Are you playing just the PR? I mean, we, we, we're not going to, you know, I know certain people don't want to talk smack or anything, but we, but we want to keep it real. You know, people don't go to New Balance just to come in third or fourth or anything. So uh, is that your ultimate goal to be the national champion this year? Yes, that's my number one goal. All right, all right. Now, um, how about during the outdoor season? Did you uh, did you go to New Balance last year um, doing outdoor or anything? Yes, I went. I ran as a freshman and uh -huh. I came in second. Oh, okay, good job, good job. Was that second overall or second on the emerging elite? Um, second overall for freshman. It was just freshman. Oh, freshman. Okay, okay, all right. So, so you're already making marks on the national level. Yes. Okay. sunk in or anything? Uh, I don't know how it would feel yet. <laughs> you just feel happy? Yes. <laughs> okay. And so, um, how hard, I mean, do your coaches push you pretty hard in practice? And yes, and um, I can really tell the difference. Like, the week I don't practice that hard, mm -hmm. that's a meet that I don't feel I don't do good at, but mm -hmm. this past week I've been practicing harder and harder every day. Mm -hmm. And I fell out to do it today, and I did it. Oh, okay. All right. All right. And you were right on the you were right on the winner's tail. 
at the very end. In fact, all, all three of you were right there together, first, second, and third. And so, um, being that you were that close, has that given you any kind of incentive to maybe eclipse the yes, winner? Um, it can tell like a big difference of who get first and second by how hard you push at the end. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And that was my coach always told me at practice. It's always a difference at the end and how you finish. Okay. So when you came into the meet, were you expecting second place? Did you did you look at some of the times and was just hoping just to place um, or what? At first. I didn't believe in myself. I could run a 54. Mm -hmm. So I just tried. I just tried to put my in the game. Mm -hmm. And I just did it. And I just, my coach told me to push pads wherever I will stop. And I just kept going. And I did it. Okay. Um, so is this your first time running here in Kentucky? Yes. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right.